Hey y'all. So I wanted to make this video in regard to the Jordan Peterson and Kathy Newman interview. I rewatched the interview and I found a lot of new things and I'm going to recommend that you also rewatch it. You're going to find things that you didn't find before. Beyond that, I did a little digging on Kathy Newman and found that despite my hopes that she was, she was in fact not simply playing devil's advocate. She was not just doing her job and playing the role that she needed as foil to Jordan Peterson, but was instead truly attempting to push an agenda and put words into Peterson's mouth. This is disheartening as it it almost takes away from the legitimacy of the interview. It almost takes away the uh, real the realness. What I like, however, is that Jordan Peterson did not slip up. He didn't get caught in any of her traps. And in fact, he parried her quite effectively. That being said, though, were she a minimum wage worker or just any worker in a normal job, if she were pushing an agenda rather than doing her job, she would be fired or at the very least heavily reprimanded. In this case, though, I don't believe that BBC4 is going to reprimand her at all. In fact, I bet they probably think she achieved some sort of victory. I, I would put it out to all of you to please, again, try to, try to assume the best of people. Try, please try to assume that people are, in fact, doing their job and have the best interest of outcome in mind. Because I truly believe that most people out there working are not pushing their agenda and do indeed have the best interest in mind. This was not the case with this interview, but I still have faith in people in general. That being said, all of you news companies, TV companies out there, Maybe you should take a look at the people that you have working for you and see if, in fact, they are working for you or if they are working for themselves, simply using your program as a proxy. Because in this case, I don't know if BBC4 has a heavily feminist agenda or if Kathy Newman is simply using BBC4 as a platform for her feminist agenda. It would sure be worth digging into though. In the meantime, my closing statement is, like, subscribe, share. Look forward to talking to you tomorrow. Bye. Oh, I'm not gonna say goodbye yet. If you have any suggestions on what I should talk about in the future, if there's any question you have for me or anything that you want my ridiculously humble opinion on, please leave a comment. I read all the comments. I try to respond to all the comments. So please leave a comment. You know that I'm going to see it and it may be implemented in the future. Now, this, this is the actual goodbye. Look, I'm reaching toward the stop button right now. Do you see it? See it? Here we go. 26, 27, 428, 429, 430, 